What's up guys, this is The Rifleman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total Let's Play as the United States. So to kind of round off up on last time, this army under Erwin Keats got absolutely smashed by the Spanish in Brest. I did win, but just by the skin of my teeth. Um, so they have promptly retreated back to Liverpool where they can rest and rearm. But the overall conquest of Spain is continuing. I've got these two stacks heading, they're probably going to head towards northern Italy. They've got these four stacks that will be converging on Paris, and I will probably... Aha! I am recruiting more. Oh god, where are you going? Well, while... So, what this arm, what I do need is artillery. So I'm going to recruit some... Oh, 12 pounders. Ah, eh, 12 pounders will work. Just start stacking up artillery in Portugal. Um, I do have this army, but I can't really... I'm going to leave you to it for now. Ah, so this army is getting reinforcements from Madrid. Fair enough. Um, but yeah, so these armies are going to stack, stacks are going to attack Paris. I'm unsure whether or not I'm going to give it back to France. I'm tempted to keep it for myself. Um, then I'm going to have to really slog through Brussels to break through this... This goddamn stacks and stacks of Prussian troops. Some of them aren't very good quality, but this head is ours. Um, then at the same time, oh, there we go. But at the same time, I want this stack and Algiers to be pushing west, and then I want this stack here in Cartagena. There is a stack. There is a stack. <laughs> um, I want to swing them round and attack Tripoli. To take the Barbary States. And the Barbary State. Ooh. Barbary States are a protector of the Ottomans. So it looks like these two stacks will push across North Africa. Take Cairo. Stam stacks will head northward to the Middle East. And then Cairo will probably raise an army to start landing on onto the Greek Peninsula and start pushing up from the south to open up a fr another front against the uh the um Prussians. So I have stacks here fighting here, I have stacks fighting through northern Italy, because I'm at war with most of the Italian states at the same time. Um, I'm at peace with the Russians. Norway. Could do an amphibious landing somewhere. Somewhere behind the lines. I'm at, I'm at peace with Russia, but I don't want to open myself up. Ooh, maybe Russia's doing some amphibious ops on the Baltic. That's quite cool. Um, but yeah, let's... So that's a stack. I'm not sure what you're doing. Sharpshooters... Let's give you a general, run you out here. First order of business, artillery. Let's get some heavy howitzers and some artillery. Then let's get some space. Some, make, some, get some, make a marine corps. First marine army. Oh, there's loads of stuff being right. I need to. I think I just need to let this tick for a bit to see what. Ooh, this army's striking distance of. Paris, but I'm not going to do it just yet. I want overwhelming numbers because I got a feeling um, Spain is allied with Prussia. I don't know why they're not crossing the border. Maybe they don't have military access. But I got a suspicion that if I take Paris, then all of these stacks may be unleashed against uh, my territory. So I need to be really quite careful. Um, and India's still India. Um, I'm going to focus on. Europe for now. <laughs> and then I've got some nice pirating going on. Eventually the Marathas will declare war on me themselves if they're not already at war. Oh yeah, they are at war. So I'm probably going to get some little raids on islands down here, in which case then Caracas. You get to have my um, recovery army Recruit two more wrong. There you go. So I have an army down here in Caracas ready to respond to every amphibious assaults. I've got lots of militia in Port Royal. Oh, I've got enough to. Okay, well, actually, you. Some of these units, rather than sitting in the capital, are going to go disperse themselves to the ports to stop anything particularly annoying from happening. No, I didn't think I could go put you there. Hard. 
line infantry. I was scared of losing these ones. Let's recruit some um, native muskimen auxilia to garrison the ports for here. Because I don't want to lose a lot of reliant riflemen. Okay, you're still pushing to the northwest. It's proper United States Army of the Second New York and Continental Marines. Knock out Panama, knock out Guatemala, go out to Team Mexico, New Spain, and Texas. Because right now I can't push west through Continental US. I'm hemmed in by my French allies. And French only, France only exists because of Corsica, isn't it? Yeah, it does. So if I attacked Corsica, they'd be at war with me. Then when I, when, when I knock them out, would their Louisiana would probably be at war with me still, even though my war made them be made them exist. I don't know. God, look at that. Prussian Jaeger's range 170. My sharpshooters. Light infantry's only 120. My sharpshooters. Oh, my sharpshooters are 170. Because they have rifles as well. Maybe I ought to get my... Oh, yeah, let's, let's do this. Matthew Tritzel. So let's get my... See if my rate can get in. Yes, he's in. Let's see if my rate can get into Brussels as well. Oh, after the frame rate drop. Oh, they got detected. My American missionaries. Still here. Not beating Catholicism because they've probably got, yeah, they've got a seminary there. They've got two modern universities. And, oh, see, you, you've got to be really unhappy. Minus nine. So there might be a decent uh, rebellion. War weariness. Interesting. So if France rebels and manages to win, I don't think they will, because they've got a, Spain has a very strong army inside Paris. But if they did, then that would be Republican Spain? Republican France, sorry. So Napoleon's ilk. Anyway. I'm going to sit and turn. Solve much more of the problem just jabbering on. I've got to go fight some people. That's what I think. See, I'm just surprised Crimea exists. I thought they'd have been gobbled up by now. Let's see what the Prussians do. If anything, it'd be tempting to not to be. It'd be tempting to wait to open up that southern front through the soft underbelly. See, it all comes. Everything comes back to World War Two in the end. Ah, they've punted out my sloop, and they'll probably destroy it. Yeah, with a second-rate ship of the line, the bomb catch. At least they sank it, and they didn't capture it. See, I'm, I'm probably going to have to send a sender stack just to sit there and bottle up the German Navy as per World War One and World War II. Um, hmm. Naples. Ooh, I don't want to... Do no, I definitely do not want to fight this. Because you see, it's, it's triggering it from Gibraltar, so it would trigger an assault. So I'd have to try and I'd have to count on these guys running up into position before they capture the form because they've got loads of melee troops. They'd be able to scale the walls super easily. No, I'm not going to fight that. I'm going to hope they don't take Gibraltar. Ah, oh, the dummies! They've messed up big time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my cavalry out, send them back to Madrid, send that army to garrison Gibraltar. Then the next time they move, I will trigger an assault or make it so they have to attack me. So I want my cavalry in to deploy them outside of the walls to attack the mortars. <laughs> Delightfully devilish. How have Spain just taken the garrison out of Paris? It looks like that's what's happened. Where are they going? Piracy. They're being pirates. Yeah, falling back to Panama. Not that it'll help them. Maluk's Norway. It was 
right. path block. Select Crack on. Oran, where is that? Local fishery, yep. They got nothing to export, so I don't really feel the need to have too many trade ports. I don't think I need have. I don't think they've given them any trade ports. Now they've got two fisheries, but then again, they don't really have. Well, then again, Morocco's got trade ports, so they can export through Morocco. Fleet destroyed, very much so. Okay. So, firstly, down here. I do this. Forward, Take out a unit of artillery. No way, I've completely done that the wrong way around. If I do that, fall these guys back with these reinforcements, clump them together, and have them be like some sort of pseudo response force. When they move out, I'll be able to. Oh well, you're definitely gonna, I'm gonna go for you again to make sure you don't run away, or make sure you don't get to reinforce your troops. Finish them off. Well, let's put them into Marseille. Okay, let's. Push them onto that little Savoy stack, just auto resolve it. Sit them here on the pass so they can keep an eye on what's going on just inside the border. Let's move you up to here because they can push down through this pass. Okay, now you. Move up, you move up. I'll use this army. Oh god! Which army is this? Just a regular bog standard army? Okay. What I want is... To stack them up like this so that I've got overwhelming odds. So I will fight that battle, and I'll come back to it. Uh, let's do that. Algiers has been upgraded. That's been upgraded. Trade routes being raided, that's fine. Um, let's quickly auto-resolve. Declare war. Don't... yeah, call in France. What? 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 Oh, super quickly. You guys, you... Quite a quick assault. Hurry up and be passive. Gonna get up in their face and be aggressive. I never saw so many shocking bad hats in my life. The House of Commons, because it's all stuff. Okay. Pretty much just going to go. Here's all of my artillery, grand battery, boom, boom. With howitzers ready to rock and roll. Keep my cav keep some cavalry there just to keep it. Keep them safe. Then have my elite troops coming in through the town. If I can deploy them. There we go. Get all my cavalry up together. With my general, why not? Okay. 
Get them on trap and shot, focus fire the camels. Quick climb shot. Is that too short range? Get my infantry to run. Nah. Camels are getting owned. Oof. Shatner Shaw being the pirates. Well, I was just realizing, I'm realizing I've got. Um, just get stuck in. Turned off fire at rank. That rank, that was dumb. Devastating losses from the. Ha! Ah, did I blow my own. I did blow my own infantry to bits. Round shot. Focus fire that unit of pirates. Cavalry. You're doing okay. Oh, don't be quick line. Ooh, camel gunners. Let's have you chase them down. Camel gunners. Speed up time. Let's get my artillery to fire on them. I'm reluctant to charge my cavalry in because they annihilate cavalry. I'm hoping my dragoons charge my infantry in. Oh, for God's sake, why are you just running around? Ooh, look at that. Delicious. Cool. Cavalry, go finish off their last unit of troops. Because that was absolutely bonkers. Do you know, make them charge the gunners. If they route now, I will chase after the guns. I will maintain this fight just so I can take out the gunners. No, chase them down. Because I just like I said, I want to kill the guns. Ha! Ah, shot them to bits. Cool. Let's mop up the last of these pirates. I'm sure my ge oh god, my general was getting massacred by my own. Um Cool. Um, I lost far too many men for that. But at least that drives them away. Push on. Do a bit of replenishment. Yeah, Howitzers, some gunners, but I feel confident with my guys. I'm going to lay siege for now. And this navy of force are going to deploy their troops to attack 
Tripoli. Then sail around them, dear boy. Right, uh, let's get you into their port. Ah, blockade them then. Cool, right. This is going to be a long part, so let's fight. The Battle of Paris. Well, actually, this first stack is pretty weak. And they have no city defences. <laughs> Could be quick. <laughs> best victory to the opponent surrenders of his own accord. It is best to win without fighting. Damn it, Sanzu, you've never played a game on Total War. Even. Okay, so I want to storm in. So, the reinforcing army is going to come from over here, I'd imagine. So, I want to get some of my artillery battery set out to provide f that can provide some good fire in that direction. Five, six. So, this is going to be my knockout. So, my anticipation is that this is because this is Paris and this enemy four is up to the north. There's going to be some guys coming from up in this direction. So, Ooh, not ideal. But what I'm anticipating is this: there's an army here. I'd like to have something over here to provide fire on whatever reinforcements come from this direction if they need to be backed up by some line infantry units and a unit of sharpshooters so be it it's a bit of a bad position for these cannons over here is probably better marginally Okay, now the remainder of these troops. Hmm. Might deploy one more on this line, just in as an insurance policy. And then these two guys, these guys fill the gap. Granted. Hey, the Green Mountain Boys. And these are unit of line. So have I got one spare unit of I do. out to be ready to respond to the guerrillas. Yep, so there's the Spanish reinforcements coming up from the north. Let's get them doing round shot, trying to hit them in the rear. Cavalry charge over here! Ooh, see the canister shot missed that amount of guerrilla unit and hit that what's that, that light who's our unit? Cavalry charges. Okay, four of these guys back, get them get them get my line unit in the way to form square. Get them out to the flank. Form square, fire rank. Cannons limbered up. Come on, fire. Grand horse grenade guards have got off, so fine. Get in a position to fight like a regular infantryman. I see you. Oh, but they're a very depleted dragoon unit, so they're not going to survive long. Folks fire this unit of provincial cav. 
the lines are joining battle over here. Damn. Focus fire on the guards. So I need to swing this door around. Turn fire will on. Come on, men and men. Engage those guard infantry. Oh no. Engaging the grand air horse grand air guards. Okay, we need to get this door shut. Let's get my general up. Okay, good. Good shots going in from the artillery. Bayonet charge from the militia. Only 43 militia, so I like guards. Some dragoons are charging my line infantry. Much to their. Oh, what a pity. Good provincial cav being shot to bits. Okay, let's reorientate this line to protect my artillery. Let's spread these guys out. Good, everyone's firing on as usual. Okay, let's move these guys to the left, swing them around. You fire the Swiss Grenz, you fire the Shinia Line. There you go, engage these Swiss Grenadiers at point blank range. Fired way high. Mm, it's a lot of casualties for their regiment of foot. Am I still these guys these these guys just executing the cav the horses. Okay, that unit of lines routed. Fire on them. This might not go well. Unless, of course, you kill their general. So if they rout... Well, well I'm going to deploy stakes anyway. No time to wait. Need to reorientate my line as the second Spanish reinforcing armies are coming in. Absolutely devastating artillery shots. Absolutely devastating losses. Okay, let's run my guns up to take a position here. The rest of my line move up to here. If anything, you move up. Focus fire on that artillery unit. If I give him a volley. Bayonet charge. Get these guys to reorientate around to the left. And 
I'm not sure it was shot. Let's get my artillery in here. Spread these guys out. It could take a while for my guns to get into position. Do they have any cavalry coming in? No, they don't, so I don't have to worry about deploying stakes. Get you a lot of garrisoning that house. Send skirmishes forward. Now they get my long rifleman all engage. And let's make sure my artillery don't keep firing across their axis. Engage that howitzer unit. Hmm, why not? We've got rifleman range. If anything, this battle could be over before the artillery get here. So this regiment of line should fail fairly easily. Sharpshooters are reloading. Yeah. Aha, more conventional position. Let's pick you. Canister shot, hit that unit of the Italian regiment. You canister, uh, shrapnel shot. Focus fire that unit, the Italian regiment. Oh, they're missing. I go unlimber my artillery. Oh, that was devastating, and they are wavering already. Shaken. Sharpshooters are ready to fire at will. With the opening volley, I'm shooting down six Spaniards. Routing. Okay, pick new targets for the guns. You aim for them, you aim for them. You go for longer range. Target straight on. Ooh. Oh, that was a good shot. Yeah, these Spanish troops are going to get quite the mauling. Sharpshooters doing a very stage job. Oh, they f they form square to form tempting targets for Prussian for. American gunners! Bang! Oh, they missed. Oh! Oh, they've overshot again. Devastating. Oh, firing down. Attacking random routing squads I 
That's because I've got light infantry behaviour turned on. That's why they're still engaging. God, it's such a horrendously effective tactic. Let's turn on light infantry behaviour again. Because you actually, actually have units within range. Charge on the flank, so form square. These are only hussars. So this shouldn't be devastating. Ooh. Good hit onto the hussars. Most of them should be killed fairly rapidly. So they're light cavalry. Devastating shot against these this unit of square. Look how small it's had to rechange. Many a Spanish son is dying in this hellish field. So let's focus fire that unit that's formed square. No, focus, you focus fire this unit that's coming in. Oh god, and the shots are coming in. More cav. Swords aloft this time. However, the 77th Regiment of Foot is ready to repel them once again. Let's get aggressive. Push up one wing at least. Because these look like the remnants. The Walloon Guards. Beautiful looking troops. Guardia de Infanteria, Guardia de Infanteria. Well, you guys, I'm sorry, are going to get plucked out from a distance. So where's the general? Park him over here. To cover the gun, cover the, um... See, this is why shrapnel shots just so good. So you don't even need, don't even feel the need to be to use canister shot. I mean, I don't know if it's any better or worse than shrapnel shot, but it's pretty goddamn effective. Oh, so they're charging to the nope. They're routing. Oh, actually, I might pull back. Trouble is, I don't want to lose too many troops because I've got all those Prussians on the horizon just ready to go for me. So we need to be incredibly careful. I mean, granted, I'm not actually doing a whole lot with these guys, so... Let's 
There we go, retreat back, fall, draw the Spanish into my killing field. I'm not so bothered about annihilating them. Um, I would be happy with my general to try chase down some of these uh, Wallyan guard. There we go. That's what you get for firing your weapons. Pick round shot and have them fire off a red rear target. Ooh, wavering. A few more volleys. Broken, 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 broken. Right. Let's get my general into gear. Nothing should. No, there's all the infantry now. Go after that weakened unit guard of infantry here. You have them focus fire this unit. If these guys get some good caster shots, that would be... Oh, General's charging out front. Oh, they fired. Oh, they fired a bit to the rear. No, come on. Go this way. The big thing is, is just how much they will chop through. go but I'm fairly sure I might just hit speed up because this is all that's left is this unit which I will fire at just with canister shot for now just to see if I can actually make them route before my infantry get there I have to round shot Maybe they reorientate to attack my sharpshooters, but I've got a feeling after the first volley. Fleeing. General, where are you at? No. Continue. Let's just. Quick time, have my general chase down some Spaniards. Because these are good troops as well. Because one of these armies was a supporting army, so it's not as though by defeating them in Paris I will destroy the army forever. There will still be some Spanish stacks running around. But they're, they're all about to flee anyway. Excellent. Very satisfying. So we only need one. Only need one more um, province, not the Spanish out of the game. However, that province is Rome. Ready. Okay, I know you hate me. And I'm going to keep you. What I'm going to do. Knock down the university. Knock down the university. Can't knock down the seminary. Gonna knock down this seminary. Actually not do that, because that will upset you for industrial regions. But knock down the universities, that should get rid of, that should make you happy instantly. And let's set you guys to replenish. Let's have you guys. Can you garrison this fort? You can. 
and have them sit here in case they try pushing through this direction through across the rivers. Yeah, I'm glad I got this fort garrisoned. So now if they try and attack it, they'll have to assault fort. Everyone else is doing grand. But anyway, looking at the time, I think this end this part. So thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for seeing me capture Paris. And I shall see you next time.